Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I would vlog. I haven't really done any kind of just chill vlogs at home in such a long time. So I figured let's do a vlog. Um, what I want to show you first of all though is I got this V last weekend and I haven't had it or even opened it because I wanted to show it in a vlog and it's like a grey colour, purpley colour V but I don't know if you've guys seen it before. When you move it, it becomes like it's like there's liquid metal inside of it. So this is what it normally looks like. And then underneath, you can kind of see the stuff. So I'm going to flip it. And then you should be able to see eventually. I don't want to shake it too much. Oh, there we go. Oh, there you go. It's starting to happen. But you can see the stuff inside of it. How cool is this? I have no, no idea at all what the flavor is. Oh, there we go. And it turns, it starts looking like, um, like metals melted inside of it. Isn't that cool? Noisy. Obviously, it's probably so bad for you, but I really wanted to try it. So, I'm going to find a spot. Maybe I'll get Trav to hold the phone and I'll try it. I'm really scared, but look at that. That is so, so cool. Okay, Trav is now on phone holding duty. But yeah, so that's what it looks like. I'll give it a try. Oh, I can't open that. It's really hard. I don't laugh. Do you need me to open it? <laughs> I might actually. No, I got it. It's like glittery. I don't know if you can see the glitters. Did you just say the glitters? What did I don't know. <laughs> I'm excited. Doesn't taste like V. Doesn't taste sparkly. It tastes real sparkly. It tastes kind of tropically. Tropically? Yeah, when you try it? Trav's gonna try it. Uh, Trav. I don't even know if I want to try it because that <laughs> looks like you should not ingest it. Yeah. Kind of looks like paint. It tastes nice though. But then again, I do like energy drinks. Trav doesn't, so who knows? Give us your verdict. Can you taste the sparkles? Yeah, heaps of sparkles. Lots of sparkles. Do you like you it? Shit out sparkles. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> but do you like it? It tastes quite nice. Yeah. I don't know what it tastes like, but yeah, I think it tastes just like a tropical drink. Quicksilver X Men. Oh, is that what it's for? It's for yeah, X Men. For X Men. I never looked at it. Okay, that makes a bit of sense. It doesn't say a flavour from what I can see, but yeah, it's for X-Men, by the way. Um, but yeah, Trav and I are going to watch Fear the Walking Dead now, and yeah, I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. I, I don't know if I showed you guys or not, but I got a new onesie, and it's a cow, and it's very exciting. If I uh, can show you. There we go. It's got horns and floppy ears and a big nose and I love it so so warm and as we're getting to winter it's really nice um what I'm gonna try to do now I'm actually petrified like honestly I bought these beet face wax strips and I've never used any kind of wax strips or anything in my life so it's very scary I want to do it on my eyebrows um I don't know why I decided to try it but it just seemed a lot quicker and less painful than any other option for my eyebrows so yeah I thought you know what let's get them give them a go but it's scary have any of you guys ever used wax strips on your eyebrows before I don't know <laughs> says it's only got five steps so hopefully I can not screw it up test your skin reaction I don't want to wait 24 hours um, I've waited until tonight to do it just because I didn't want to do it during the weekday and do something wrong and then like have something wrong and don't know how to fix it or if it like reacts and then it gets really red I don't want that to happen either so yeah I don't know if I'll be able to film me doing it if I can I will maybe I don't know maybe I'll try to put my phone somewhere in here do I need to be in the bathroom to do it I wouldn't imagine so let me open it and I'll get back to you okay I found a spot to put you so let's do a Vite face wax strips with easy grip unboxing. That lighting's terrible, isn't it? I'm right underneath a light. Instructions. Oh my god, they're tiny. What is this? Perfect finish wipes. 
I guess you use that after you've done it. I don't know if you guys can read that, but that's clearly not English. So that's a great start. Looks like these are little wax strips. Oh, this is terrifying. My heart is racing right now. I should probably do this in front of a mirror actually, so I can actually see what I'm doing. I guess you just tear them like this. Oh, it's not tearing properly. So I'm guessing you peel, but you must like heat them up, peel one side, whack it on and go whoosh. Um, but yeah, I am going to have to do this in front of a mirror, so I'm going to go do it. I'll be back and I'll let you know how I go. Or I'll be back and I haven't done it because I'm too scared. Alright, so I couldn't film it, but I literally just finished. It only took like two minutes and that was it. And it was super, super painless. I thought I was going to have to use like four of these strip things, but I didn't actually realize when you peel it apart, you end up with two strips. So that's really cool. And yeah, I don't know if I mentioned, but super painless. It was great. And by the way, I wasn't doing that because this is sponsored or anything, but if someone wants to sponsor me, go ahead. <laughs> um, but no. That was really exciting actually, and it feels so smooth. Um, in terms of the pain, as I said, it was painless, but I guess if you're someone who uses tweezers on your eyebrows, literally, if you do one pluck, that is what one strip is like. So you can do like your whole eyebrow with what you'd get for the pain of just one pluck. So yeah, I'm so excited. This thing here, the um, Perfect Finish Wipes, it's like a wax paper with some like oily stuff on it and it just made my whole face well not my whole face but like the area really oily and greasy so I just used a face wipe to wash it off I don't know if it's maybe the oils are supposed to be good but I didn't like having oil on my face so I don't know if I'll use it again next time but yeah now I have like all of these left over and and even more so these are gonna last ages because I only used one I didn't like the fact that they're so thick though like, I only want to just, like, tidy it up. So the fact that the strip is freaking massive, I feel like I ripped half my face off. But, yeah, that was my first time using wax strips. I, I know this is really weird vlogging it, but it's something new for me. And it's something that's not a big deal to probably 99% of the population. But if you're someone who's never used wax strips before, that is my honest review. It's not as scary as you think. Be brave, like a cow that I am I don't know but yeah that was fun I just realized on this thing it says face wax strips with easy grip but then where there's actually that little picture of the lady down the bottom it says upper lip cheeks and chin so that's probably why they're so thick um so they're not designed for your eyebrows but oh well I did it anyway um but your cheeks I suppose everyone does have hair on their cheeks but I'd never thought about waxing them wouldn't that just like grow back really long? And I wouldn't want to do my upper lip either. That would be scary. So scary. Ooh, so it's much later in the evening now. And Trav has demanded a Milo. But not one made with just like the kettle and stuff. He likes it when you get a big glass, fill it up with milk, put it in the microwave, and then you add the Milo. And it actually tastes so much nicer that way. I don't want one though, so I'm just going to make one for Trav. I did also do my nails. I don't know if you can tell, but they're like a pastel purple kind of color. Get the milk. Uh-oh. Oh, please don't fall. Oh, I did it. I don't know if you're about to hear me over the microwave, but I'm sure you can. Um, so I just put in lots of milk. It's probably about one and a half cups, maybe. Just under one and a half cups of milk. And then he actually wants the Cadbury drinking chocolate instead of Milo. Which is fine, because I prefer the Milo and he prefers the drinking chocolate. So it's Hander. Um, and then he said two teaspoons. So yeah, if you want to know how to make it, that's how. But it always turns out really nice. But yeah, I, pref I definitely prefer Milo then. The drinking chocolate kind. Go out. Oh, don't make a mess. And then, right, I feel like I'm gonna mess this up just because I'm not. Oh, it's all stuck. Oh, paying attention. Oh my gosh, I have to take a leap. Oh. One. Can I do another one? Oh my goodness, how did I do that and not make a mess? And that is all there is to it. 
Ooh, you're under a hypnosis. Oh, ouch, it's really hot. Thank you. That's okay. It's hot, hold on. That's fine. Ah, it's really hot. It's fine, I can grab it. I think this explains it all. <laughs> But yeah, that's going to be it for this vlog because I feel like it's getting really long, but I also feel like I haven't done too much. So I'm going to end it here um, and I might as well just upload it now so you will get the vlog on the evening that it was filmed. Thumbs up for that. Um, but yeah, I'm just about to play you guys a little clip from last Sunday or Monday. I can't remember. But Steph took the GoPro and she put the um, chest strap on Adam. So he was running around the beach and doing stuff. So... Yeah, um, it is a little bit shaky, but it was quite loose on him, so it's kind of jumping up and down a little bit. And then he does fall over at the end, so it got water on it. Um, so I kind of had to cut that stuff out. But maybe we'll go and get some more footage with Adam and try and make it so that it's more stable. But yeah, it's really cute anyway, so I'll play that for you now, and it's probably going to be the last clip. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this real chilled out vlog, and thanks for watching. I think I will continue vlogging tomorrow, um, but I do actually have vlog footage from last Saturday, so that's going to go up after this one, and then you'll get tomorrow's vlog after that one. I don't know, they'll come out. Hope you guys enjoy, don't forget to subscribe if you're new, and you want to see more videos, and yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye.